Can I talk really quickly about all the licensing deals that are happening at Toys R Us? I mean, they've always had a lot of toys, but I've noticed today there's so many different licensing deals. I mean, like you'll have one game and four different covers. Like you'll have one game, like I just showed you, and Disney Princess or Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles or, you know, Paw Patrol. I mean, look where I am. Look at all these matching games, right? Lion Guard, you have Disney, right? And then you have the memory game. I mean, really, aren't all these games basically the same? It's just that they're going to have different types of characters on it, whether it's, you know, um, the Minions or Mickey Mouse or Lion King. So I think that's really interesting. Like, I come to Toys R Us a lot, but for some reason, there just seems to be a lot more licensed products at Toys R Us today. So that must be like a new thing that's happening with companies and how they're licensing their products and what they are licensing. So pay attention to that. Here we have licensing at its finest. We all know the whole Tic Tac Toe Toss Across game, but now we have them licensed out to Paw Patrol, which is Spin Master. We have the Toss Across Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and we also have the Dino Trucks Toss Across. So based on which character you like, you can find a Toss Across in your character. Oh, and did I fail to mention Disney Frozen? Let's see who makes this. I mean, it says Disney Frozen, but let's see who's Cardinal. So. As you can see, there's four different toss acrosses for different types of activity. Well, it's the same activity, but based on which character you like the most. Okay, earlier I was talking about licensing, so here's another example. So here we have Guess Who, which is the Guess Who game made by Hasbro, right? And then we have the licensed product, which is the Finding Dory. Same game, Guess Who, but instead this has Dory characters. Same game, different characters. So here we have. Finding Dory, which is, you know, the Disney, the whole Disney game, and then we have Guess Who. But either way, they're both being manufactured and both being um, produced by Hasbro. But I'm just going to show you, trying to show you how, like, this whole licensing thing is totally taking over Toys R Us, because before, you would just see Guess Who. But now there's, like, two games. I'm sure there's another Guess Who game that I just haven't seen yet. But don't you guys think that's really fascinating, how licensing has taken over Toys R Us in terms of, like, products and how, like... You won't just see one game, you'll see like one game with like five different characters on it. I think that's really something that we should all pay attention to.